Now, how important is oxygen? What happens when we get sufficient oxygen to maintain ourselves, but not sufficient to keep ourselves healthy? How and why can the body be damaged by a lack of oxygen? What health restoring benefits can be experienced by increasing our oxygen through oxygen-based therapies? And from these questions, medical experts, scientists from the well, around the world for decades have been trying to answer and develop theories around oxygen therapy. In fact, in 19, or 1870, Andrew Smith, a medical doctor, won the prize essay for his article calling oxygen gas as a remedy for disease. Dr. Smith also cited a French physician, Callaghan's, uh, as being the first physician to administer oxygen as a therapeutic treatment as far back as 18, or 1783. And since that time, the research on oxygen therapy and its benefits have been documented by thousands of researchers and scientists around the world. These experts have all concluded that the lack of oxygen in human cells and tissues is linked to a vast array and a variety and possibly all health problems and disease due to the lack of oxygen or insufficient oxygen. They've also concluded that various supplementation of oxygen therapies, including stabilized oxygen and oxygen supplements, have a remarkable physiological benefit to human beings.